Hello everyone. I'm gonna show you how to get this makeup look over here. So let's begin. I'm going to start off by priming my face with Angel Veil from this. Just use your favorite primer. Next, I'm going to take a cream blush, and this is Sephora's blush in the color Blush Me. It is a cream. So I'm going to dot it on only the apples of your cheeks, like so. And then you want to take your fingers and blend it up. Next, we're gonna bake. So I'm taking my NYC powder. I'm just using that to make everything stay in place. So now we'll move on to the really fun part, which would be the eyes. I'm going to take the Urban Decay Naked 3 palette. I'm going to mix the color Dust and Burn Out together. And we're just going to apply that all over the lid. So we're just going to try and build a V shape on the side over here as well, like so. Okay. Next, I'm going in with the Sweet Peach palette, taking the color Summer Yum. I'm applying that in my crease. You just want to work it back and forth. And that's Summer Yum. Right there. Next, I'm going to go in with Peach Pit. This is a purpley brown shade. I'm only applying that to the outer V area. 
and I'm going to go back in with Summer Yum and put that on my lower lash line. Like that. And then I'm going into the Sephora Anthology palette and I'm pulling out that shade, which is a orangish gold color. We're going to place that on the center and the inner tear duct of our eyes. And don't worry if you guys make any mistakes because no, by no means am I really a professional. So, you just gotta play with what you think looks good. Next I'm taking a brown liquid lighter, liner, lighter, whatever. And this is Kat Von D's liquid liner in the shade Mad Max Brown. Try to get as close to the lash line as you possibly can. And then we're just going to create a small wing. Next, I'm taking a light brown pencil eyeliner. This is from J.Cat Beauty. And this is in the color Mosh Pit. I'm just lining my waterline area with it. And I'm just going to condition my brow. So try and help my brow products stay on all day. Then we're gonna curl our lashes with some lips. Picking up something fall on the floor. Sorry guys. Go. Now I'm going to go in with a lash primer. Hello kitten. He's rubbing his face against my leg and yowling at me. You can hear him. <laughs> okay, and next step is going in with a mascara. And this is a Maybelline mascara. Just do upper and lower lash line. So it looks something like that. Next, I'm going to take a pair of fun lashes. I'm going to use my favorite adhesive. It's from Darkness. It's a Korean brand. We're just going to apply a liberal amount, blow on it and wait for it to dry a little bit, then go in and apply it. And I'm going to take a pair of tweezers. Hi cat, he's in the chair with me now. Are you trying to make a cameo appearance, son? Hmm? Is that what you're up to? Alright, next I'm going to go in with my NYX eyebrow pencil in Auburn. And just follow my natural brow sheet.
I'm just doing little tiny strokes. Next, I'm going in with a light brown eye pencil. Eyebrow pencil, not eye pencil, I'm sorry. And just follow that same area, adding more color and dimension so it matches my natural hair a little better. And the last eyebrow product I'm going to use is a blonde eyebrow gel. Just trying to make my eyebrows look as realistic as I possibly can. So I'm going to wipe off the baking. I'm going to go in with a purple color corrector powder and just lightly tap that into my skin because I'm going to go in with a normal powder. It has a little kit on it. And just lightly put that on top as well. Next I'm taking a bronzer. Just trying to warm up that area so when I add the contour, it already has a base to it. Alright. Next, I'm taking a bronzer, a bronzer, contour powder, I'm sorry. See, I already lined my lips, and this is just a dark purple lip liner. I'm going to go over that with the Milani lipstick in Black Cherry. And you may want to use a lip brush just so you can get more precise application. I know, meow yourself. I know it. Okay, last part going on. I'm going to take a highlighter from Kat Von D. I'm taking green, green emerald. I'm going to put that underneath my brow bone on the sides of my face and my cheekbone. An absolute last step. I'm going to use a setting powder, not powder. Spray. My brain is fried today, guys. I'm sorry. I've been following Nikki's tutorial advice with fanning myself off afterwards to help it stay longer, and I think it actually works, so that's cool. Okay, this is the finished product. I hope everyone enjoyed. Thank you and have for watching, and have a great day. Like and subscribe, please. Bye. Oh, wait, someone wants to say hi. Can you sitting right behind me? No. I know it.